What's up guys, Harry here and welcome to a player review on Malapa. Malapa is a silver German striker, he plays for, and this is a mouthful, Borussia Mönchengladbach or something like that, I don't know really how you pronounce it. I played him in this team here, it was a pretty nice hybrid team, including some better players than him, or you'd think some better players than him, uh, but he played absolutely unbelievable for me. On the screen now are his in-game stats, uh, 80 shot power is the main standout thing there, the rest don't look that great. Uh, his shooting stats in general, apart from that 80 shot power, aren't that good. Uh, he's got 83 aggression, uh, which is very good, he dives into a lot of situations, uh, 88 sprint speed, which is fantastic, uh, 79 acceleration, 86 strength, he is a very strong player. Uh, that 88 sprint speed, you can feel it. As soon as he gets moving, he is like a train. He is six foot four, so a very tall player. He's got medium, medium work rate, and he is right footed. Uh, let's get on to some of the stuff I've written down about him. Uh, many people have likened him to Lukaku, uh, like the uh, the Bundesliga version of Lukaku. Uh, in my opinion, and you might think this is ridiculous, he's better than Lukaku. Um, he is such a good player. You feel so, or I, at least I felt so confident on the ball with him. Whenever I had the ball at his feet, I felt I could just run through anyone and just he would always finish it. On the screen at the moment are some examples. Of some goals I scored with him. Uh, most of them show off his strength. Like, he is so good at holding the ball up. Uh, players can't get near him because he just barges them off. Uh, his shooting is absolutely unbelievable. Uh, he's just. Uh, his shot, it doesn't. It's not like. How do I explain it? It's not doesn't feel that controlled. It's just you hit it and it just flies in, but you don't feel you can control it. As soon as you just press shoot and just let it do what it does, and it just seems to go in the top corner all the time. His finesse shot is uh, surprisingly good. Uh, I find like I've had two shots with two shots coming up soon with him uh, that I finessed and they went in pretty easily. Uh, and you'd have thought with a player with just shot power that he possesses, they wouldn't be very good. Uh, but all of them that I all the finesse shots I tried with him felt to fall in the right place. Seemed like they fell in. The the right place, 90% uh, of the time. He's very tall, six foot four, uh, which is great for a striker, especially coupled with his pace. Uh, six foot four is very tall uh, to say he's got like 84 pace on card or whatever. Uh, so that means he can win a lot of stuff in the air. I didn't score too many headers with him. I think now is an example of a header. Yeah, you'll see it now. Look, he wins that header first of all, very unlikely to hit the bar, and then rises past two players to win another header. So his heading is definitely a key attribute, uh, and he's not very expensive. He costs. Uh, I picked mine up for like 9,000 coins, uh, but with the market crash. Uh, market crash coming. You can definitely pick him up for around 6,000 coins. There is an example of his uh, shot power. Uh, it's so good. I think here's a finesse shot as well. Yeah, and look, finesse shot, easy as you like, into the bottom right corner. Uh, but as I was saying about his price, uh, if he was like in the BPL or any other more popular league, the Bundesliga, you can actually quite often find some very cheap players. Uh, but if he was in any other more expensive league, uh, he'd be going for an absolute bucket load. Take Lukaku, for example. He goes for 60,000 coins. And this guy, as I said at the start, uh, I feel is better. So to recap, he has got fantastic strength. Uh, that is one of the main things I like about him. He's got great pace for his size. Uh, it says 84 pace on his card, but with that 88 sprint speed, as soon as he gets moving, he is basically unstoppable. He's very tall, so he's good in the air. His shot power is fantastic. He's got a surprisingly good finesse shot. Uh, you wouldn't expect it, but it's there. He's not very expensive for a silver. The only downsides we have to him is his dribbling's a bit hit and miss. Uh, sometimes he can really not control it that well. And he doesn't have four-star skills. Only three-star skills, three-star weak foot. Uh, so that's the only thing he's really lacking. Uh, but in the end, I'm going to give him a 9 out of 10. A very high rating, you might think. Uh, but I think to say he's a silver player, he's that cheap, and the way he performs in game, I honestly think he deserves that rating. He's one of my favourite players I've used so far this year. Um, I actually scored 23 goals in 8 games with him. I'll leave like a Gaiazu in the description if you want proof of that. Uh, but he was just so good for me. I'd highly recommend him. Go and try him out. Uh, that's it for me. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.